करो करो ओके आई एम नॉट हैविंग माइक लैब एट माय सिस्टम सो either we can just use the powerpoint or we can meet on wednesday were you getting my email is there any other way to contact you before class if there is any other change in the schedule oops let me check get some help okay i i'll talk about financial time series and maybe uh, by witness that i would have matlab installed in my system i'll keep this short i'll give you some ideas to think you might have accessed uh, on the QC finance premium page you can download the financial time series uh, pdf which uh, talks about many aspects here i'll take you through the pdf and some of the interesting things that we have and maybe we'll do some more practice on wednesday so before i move ahead uh, i want to talk about this concept uh, of creating skeleton or creating constructor or creating object you can interchangeably use these three words so our idea is to get everything into a financial time series object so that if you want to do anything uh, like uh, get uh, daily returns or directly calculate uh, the volatility or scale up the volatility to annual numbers by multiplying root 250 or uh, or find a correlation with a correlation between two items or or have a data structure in terms of uh, open close high low the the format that we get for the financial data so keeping all these things into consideration they have created a financial time series object which is a skeleton or a framework or a matrix uh, which has many metrics in itself so that when you want to play around with data you can easily do that this financial time series uh, object can also be connected to yahoo server or other servers that you are using i think i talked a little bit about if you have matlab you can try these things right now so the first concept starts with constructor constructor is to create a blank skeleton just the framework without any data and then uh, you can point data to parts of this skeleton or this frame text file may be important when you so once they around the object many operations like if you want to do some technical analysis 
and since this object gives you support for as i told you opening closing high low and both of those are the it will get around with if you look at analysis handling first part the time series object numbers into we have been talking about that we can give argument ones ones that are at the right are optional to start now a cons an option i am reconstructed like this is proud first have uh, find columns it's like excel file data is that standard data, which out of the the close price which the other so this starts with uh, getting data into the system so i'm going to using these a run through is have a uh, inserted value uh so then they have you that variable in object example if you have you can from here eight series put into the final allocate place yes object which is a financial time series object so you, uh, the i to understand uh, how you are going to so it to excel down with that if you see we read then data series we can have of two is then getting some involved in playing with date format so in sas and r in matlab playing around with date format becomes most tricky once you can do that you can look at like exponential smoothing which typically works lot of other thing and like from this or the name i'll go and i'll write uh, matlab me arguments and what like if you want to or financial i doubt whether we can do that does that like wait in this file support for that. do just one done that you have to create of them and instead i have something those are but for the portfolio the other easier way is uh, to create your own skeleton but if you are using some transformation or exponential smoothing and you want to automate work, you can Uh, this file the man and you might have the password you have to uh, the solve to get these things tab uh, either way put in some rank and you have to matlab so here
if you have any other idea in mind do let me know go through the financial time series uh, pdf in case you want to try anything you can let me know see you on wednesday